Are viruses alive? Viruses are infectious, tiny, and nasty. But are they alive? The answer is not really, although it depends on how you define alive. It's challenging to define life, but the seven characteristics of life comes close. It includes these criteria. All living beings must be able to respond to stimuli, grow over time, produce offspring, maintain a stable body temperature, metabolize energy, consist of one or more cells, and adapt to their environment. However, these seven characteristics are more like guidelines. Take reproduction, for instance. Viruses are packaged strands of DNA or RNA and can only make copies of themselves if they hijack the machinery of living cells. So viruses can't reproduce on their own, but neither can a mule, the sterile offspring of a horse and a donkey, and mules are clearly alive. Also, let's talk about growing over time. Rocks can grow by gaining minerals over time, and we know that rocks are not alive. Perhaps a simpler definition of life is needed. Does it have self-generated and self-sustaining actions? That is, does it seek out food and take actions to further its life, like an animal seeking shelter or a plant sprouting roots? A virus does neither of these things. Instead, viruses are inert unless they come into contact with a living cell. Given this definition, a virus is not alive. Are viruses alive? Just another one of Life's Little Mysteries. If you like even more Life's Little Mysteries, check out these videos and read even more on LiveScience.com.